Vera Clinic presents. My name is Nick Maddock. I'm from St. Louis, Missouri, in the United States of America. Uh, I'm here in Istanbul, Turkey, at Vera Clinic to undergo my first uh, hair transplant surgery. Uh, I found out about Vera Clinic online. Um, I've honestly been researching uh, different methods for, for hair loss for many years. Um, just in recent months, I really started to kind of plan and, and pull the trigger on taking action. So um, when I started looking on Google, at first I, I looked at prices in America and knew that that just wouldn't be affordable for me. Some hair loss uh, transplants are going for about 20,000 US dollars there. Um, so then when I started looking at options in Istanbul, Turkey, I was very satisfied given the reputation of the doctors, the reviews that I found online, uh, the client testimonials, uh, and then ultimately the price too that, that was offered for such services. So uh, when I started to look online, I, I vetted several different clinics in the area. I probably had a, a graph of about 12 or 13 different clinics here in Istanbul, Turkey, and ultimately decided that Vera Clinic was uh, gonna be best for me. Uh, it seemed like they were the most reputable. Um, they were leading the industry in research and development on the Sapphire Few method. Um, so ultimately, uh, you know, I, I felt I felt at ease and I felt confident with this clinic. So I came over here from uh, Munich, Germany. So a very short flight. It's about two and a half hours. I arrived at the airport. Um, Beforehand, all the information was given me via uh, WhatsApp text messaging on where I needed to go and who I needed to meet. All right, well, we just landed in Istanbul and the airport's pretty nice. Um, so now I'm uh, heading down to meet my driver. Feels so fancy, right? Once I left the airport, there my driver was waiting for me. Uh, they took me out in a very nice Vera Clinic branded vehicle and uh, brought me to my hotel. Nicholas is currently in his hotel room, where he'll spend his first night in Istanbul. Tomorrow will be an important eventful day that will change his life. Nicholas has a love for travel and adventures. He likes to write about his passion in his journal and share pictures of his adventures on his Instagram account. Here goes nothing. Morning of, about to be picked up, head to the clinic. Ah, bye, beautiful hair. He's currently in a private car being escorted to the hospital and enjoying the views Istanbul has to offer during the ride. Included in the package is the hotel, the transport to and from the airport. Uh, so far, it's been pretty seamless and pretty easy, so I hope it continues the rest of the way through the journey. At the same time, preparations for receiving Nicholas and the hair transplant have started at the hospital. All the procedures should occur based on schedule. Upon arrival, the crew was prepared to receive Nicholas and begin with the necessary paperwork. Um, so here I am, it's, uh, it's about 11 a.m. on the day of the transplant, and. Um, I'm excited. I'm feeling good. Uh, looking forward to what the day holds. After having his pictures taken, Nicholas was then admitted to a primary test. The doctor began the hairline design and confirmed the technique of hair transplantation agreed, on which is the Sapphire Few based on the pictures and evolutions performed via WhatsApp during the online consultation. Nicholas was then admitted to several other tests necessary for the surgery. More pictures were taken after hairline designed for comparison during the growing phase. Nicholas was then sent to the washing room to have his hair shaved. After this step, Nicholas was sent to the operation theatre and the surgery began. Nicholas will be injected with local anaesthetic, meaning he will be awake without feeling pain throughout the surgery. The surgery will constitute three stages. The first stage is extraction of grafts from the donor regions. The grafts are handled delicately to preserve them for implantation. 
During the second stage, a doctor will begin opening channels in the recipient's sites using sapphire blades. In the last stage, the doctor will implant the grafts in the open channels. Nicholas's surgery lasted six hours, where he then was transported to his hotel for a much needed rest. A new day has come. Um, I'm now here for the second day, just got washed and cleaned up, um, and I'm really ready to see what the results have in store for me over the next few weeks and months. During his second day of his medical tourism trip, Nicholas was preparing for a clinical washing session where a special gel is applied to safely remove blood clots. After 30 minutes, he was admitted to a clinical washing session where his scalp was carefully washed and sterilised. Nicholas was then placed under a cold laser machine for 15 minutes to help the wounds heal faster. receive a thorough explanation on how to use the products. Uh, so overall, I'm, I'm pretty satisfied. Uh, the operation procedure itself was actually pretty quick, um, so I'm pretty satisfied from that front. The facilities were extremely clean. Um, I think that was actually above my expectations, uh, so I was very happy with that. I mean, it is a true medical facility that um, that you're getting the procedure in. So, uh, pretty happy all around, pretty satisfied. Overall, I've enjoyed my experience. Thanks to your clinic and I hope the best for all. In this respect, Nicholas has finished all the stages of the procedure and is ready to go back home with a new look. And we wish Nicholas a quick and safe recovering and to achieve the best results possible.